everyone. Welcome to the kids' story room. Today's poem is read by Sebi. Spelled a pearl of pajamas. I hope you like it. Bye. <laughs> Pete's Playful Pyjamas Pete had a pair of pyjamas that really loved to play. Pete's pyjamas thought bedtime was the beginning of the day. As soon as Pete laid down to rest, his pyjamas would stand up tall, leap off the bed, out of the door and somersault through the hall. Oh, Pete, his mum and dad cried out. It's time to go to bed. I can't, yelled Pete, munching carrots while standing on his head. My pyjamas will not let me. They want to have some fun. They say it isn't time for sleep, but time to jump and run. Pete's mum and dad shook their heads as Pete leapt over a chair. Come on, he sang, let's play. Catch me if you dare. Pete went zooming down the hallway with his mum and dad in tow. Pete knew they'd never catch him. They were way too slow. Pete flew across the couches, ducked in and out of drawers, slipped in and out of cupboards, dove in and out of drawers. Pete's mum and dad were puffed. They stopped to have a rest. Pete went whizzing past. My pyjamas are the best. They watched as Pete swung wildly from a precious ceiling light. They wondered if anyone would get to sleep that night. We must get Pete new pyjamas, his mum and dad agreed. Pete cried out from the tabletop. There really is no need. These pyjamas are my favourites. They're the best I've ever had. You should get yourselves a pair. Don't you reckon, Dad? Pete's dad shrugged his shoulders. You know, I think you're right. Mum and I will get some. Just not to wear at night. What a good idea, Mum said. We'll wear them in the day. Then it will not matter how long we want to play. But now it's time to go to sleep. You need to rest your head. So let's take these pyjamas off and you can go to bed. All right, said Pete, I guess you're right. I'm feeling a bit sleepy. And these pyjamas will never tire. They're really very cheeky. So Pete took his pyjamas off and his mum tucked him in tight. Tomorrow we'll get new PJs, said Dad, so we can all sleep well at night. That was fun. When I'm five, I can read the story too. But until then, <laughs> when, until then, I see you next time. See ya. I have Se- Sebby. I have Mummy and Daddy and Sebby. <laughs>